Konnichiwa, I mean, this is Tisa Curry, and you're watching Pokecast. Today's 10 minute first impression is going to be on a PS4 game. A very evil game called V. Or also known as V. 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 Depends on how you like to pronounce it. For any of you who have played this game, you know exactly what I mean about this evil game. The concept is amazing, and it is a great game. But it is one of those games that will make you cry, cringe, and swear to never play video games ever again after playing it. After you see some of the video, if you all have not seen this game, you will understand what I am talking about. As always, first time playing the game, or version thereof, can't skip anything, and I get 10 minutes to play the game. <sighs> this is going to be fun. Let's start that timer. Timer has been started, and let's play the evil game. So basically, the whole concept is... Um, our ship crashes, and now I have to go and save everybody. Uh-oh. Is everything okay? Something's wrong. We're going to crash. Something! Ah! And other things happen. But because I'm unable to read fast enough... Yeah. Phew! That was scary. At least... We all... Escape. Right, guys? Guys! Hello! Guys? Oh, come on! Move the direction of hand! Or oh, left stick! See, and this is the thing that makes it evil. You get to, um, change the gravity of your situation, if you will. I wonder why the ship teleported me here alone. I hope everybody else got all okay. Yeah, death to me. Stop. Oh, and there goes my first death. I think there's a trophy in this game just for dying. I love the graphics, though. This is one of those games that so could have been released back then. And it would have been awesome. Oh, wait, what's this? Activate terminal. Personal log. Almost everybody, everyone has been evacuated from this space station now. The rest of us are leaving in a couple of days. Once our research has been completed. And go! <laughs> Literally, this game... Okay. Help! Can anyone hear the message? Violet, is that you? Captain, you're okay! Oh, wait, he's the captain. Maybe I should be speaking like this. Something has gone horribly wrong with the ship's teleporter. I think everyone has been teleported aw away randomly. They could be anywhere. Oh, no. I'm on the ship. It's damaged badly, but it's still intact. Where are you, Captain? I'm on some sort of space station. It seems pretty modern. There seems to be some sort of interference in the this dimension. I'm broadcasting the coordinates of the ship to you now. Oh, it's only over there. Right. I can't teleport you back, but uh, if you can't find a teleporter... Anywhere nearby, you should be able to teleport me. Teleport back to me. Oh, I'll try to find one. Good luck, Captain. I'll keep trying to find the rest of the crew. Whoop, boing. Oh, that was so my fault. Yes. Remember that you can press L1 and L1 check where you are on the map. Oh. Groovy. Uh, 
and uh, it's a go. It's a go. It's a go. Yay! I crap. Nicely done. Oh, I wonder what this is. Hmm. I probably don't recall need it. Oh, whoop. <laughs> I probably don't really need it. But it might be nice to take it. Back to ship to study. Oh, this is going to suck. Oh! Oh, and I get killed again. Okay, let's try this again. And down, and not that down. Love the music of this game. I actually have the soundtrack, and I love this one. It's just Mega Man inspired almost. If you will. Okay, just one more. Nice! Congratulations, you have found a shiny trinket. One out of twenty. Mwah. And you just kill yourself, I know. Oh crap! No, oh, oh crap. Not good. Wait for it, there it goes, and wait for it again. There we are. Press the option button to view. Oh! Whoa! See what happens when you- Oh! Daggummit. Hmm. Oh! Hello there! Uh, I no, dang it. <laughs> oh, no, great, Chitty Bob. Yes! I made it! <laughs> I'm a ghost, be afraid. Whoa! Goodbye, mister. You? A teleporter! I can get back to the ship with this! Game save. Teleportation. Captain! Romance scene. Start. You have rescued a crew member. For Romaine. Alright, press the button to continue. <laughs> so, Doctor, have you any idea what caused this crash? There seems a sort of a bizarre signal here that's interfering with our equipment. It caused the ship to lose its uh, quantum position Collapsing us into this dimension. Oh no. But I think we should be able to fix it, the ship and get out of here. As long as we can find the rest of the crew. Really don't know anything about this place. <sighs> that would suck. <laughs> I'm afraid this could be anywhere. <laughs> They can they teleport back here? Not unless they find some way to communicate with us. We can't pick up the signal and they can't teleport here unless they know where the ship is. So what do we do? We need to find them. Head out into the dimension and look for anything anywhere they might have ended up. Okay, where do we start? Well, I've been trying to find them while the ship's 
uh, with the ship scanner. I can't not talk today. Wow. It's not working. But I did find something. Oh, crap. Metroid inspired. Um, this point shows uh, our scans have high energy potentials. There's a good chance they'll teleport us. Which means there's probably built near something important. They can be very good place to start looking. Okay, I'll head out and see what I can find. I'll be right here if you need any help. Whoa! Hmm, this looks like something good. Shiny thing. Victoria loves to study the interesting things we find on our adventures. I hope she's okay. Oh, that's right. Store them. Gotcha. There, there goes the timer. Okay. The game is as evil as I remember it. Well, the first time I played it on Steam. Yes. This is a period of a game. As you saw, the only real things you have is walking around and changing gravity. That could only spell out more disastrous effects in the game. Um, game, I just highly recommend, try it. It is pure evilness and a great game to play. Graphics are fantastic. It remind me of playing, you know, um, an Armstrad CPC or, you know, any of the PCs back then. I mean, that's what it looks like. The music is absolutely fantastic. Really enjoy the music. But it's just one of those games that you can only play so much of it because it's so pure evil. Um, so if you're looking for a great Metroid clone that shows that yes, you can make a harder version of Metroid, here you are. I highly recommend it. Best part is it's available for any system out there. So... You get to enjoy it various many times and getting your achievements on Steam, Xbox Live, and on the PSN. If you don't want trophies, well don't worry. There's also a 3DS uh, version of the game and a Wii U version. Since they still have not uh, done that yet. So I hope you guys have enjoyed watching this evil game. And I hope you guys um, have fun playing the game because it is that awesome of a game. This is Tisa Kura saying ciao and sayonara.